And away they go from the 1600 meter marker. A little bit of an untidy beginning. Wolfston, the first one to find stride. Raven's Sword is right there in second and probably going to challenge. There you'll see Kelvin Abib just gives a niggle or two on Raven's Sword and looks to press past Wolfston. Goes on by three parts. Death Blow's hard held to the inside and Clean Slate moves into third, relegating Death Blow fourth. Fernie racing away in fifth position. Color of Money is in sixth spot. Bobati on the outside, seventh. Daunt the Music in seventh spot on the inside. Further back, Bray Voyager. They're about eight lengths off the leaders. Denver. Galaxian at this point in time is on the right-hand side and easily nine or ten lengths off as they start to stretch out and Roy's hopeful can't go with them. Raven Saw taking the bull by the horns coming to the final 700. Gone two lengths clear from Wilston in second. Clean Slate. The blue cap is on the outside of Death Blow. Then in comes Fernie. Colour of Money's further back in the running. Homeward bound, 400 metres to go. Raven soared by two. Wolfston back in second. Clean slate could be the big danger. Hooks towards the inside, the blue cap. 300 out, and here comes Clean Slate with a big looking challenge. Raven soared now second. 200 metres to go. Clean slate. Race over. Clean Slate and Ashton Aries drawing away for a bloodless victory to win by two and a half to three. Raven Sword second, then came Fernie, and it's a photo Wolfston and Death Blow. The Goth Puller Outfit, the Time Thief, Clean Slate. Zunamas. Madison Park stud, Ashton Aries. I was going to look to angle out, but then darted towards the inside. Wins by around about three lengths. Clean slate. Raven sword second. Fernie. And then Wolfston puts the nose down probably just ahead of death blow. So number four, Wolfston, and then one death blow. Clean slate, there you'd see hooked towards the inside of Raven Sword at the 300 and still traveling very, very comfortably. Finds top gear, goes away from the rest of the field, who are all apparently under pressure inside the last 200 meters, and it's all over by the shouting. Number 11, Clean Slate, goes off the favorite at 4 Rand and 190. Back to the studio. Second race of the day has gone the way of the very consistent clean slate from the Garth Puller stable for Mr. Zernema and Ashton Aries, Nadison Park stud bred, and Olani is here with me, and he gets a thousand rand on behalf of Hollywood Bets and on behalf of Gold Circle, who have contributed to the thousand rand. Uh, Olani, congratulations, well done. Yeah, Thank you very much. Let's get Ashton Aries in. Ashton, congratulations. And it's the first time you're riding clean slate in a race, but no doubt you would have done some work at home. I just want to <laughs> and uh, congratulations with uh, this win. He's really won well. Thank you, Mr. Lafone. He was obviously the right horse today in this field. Um, the draw was a concern. Uh, Mr. Puller told me you know, I must go forward with him in trying a good position. We said that he won a good race. He certainly did, and based on the strength of today's win, we don't want to get too excited because, of course, it's a, it's a, it's a maiden field, but could he maybe go on and give the owner some more fun? Yes, no, I think he was actually going quite well. Mr. Puller wanted him to sit a little bit longer, you know, and I felt this was wants to go underneath me, so I let him go. He won a good race. The rest of your rides, can you have another winner today? We all know your best rides in the last race. That's only a joke, but uh, tell us about the rest of your rides. You know, Mr. Lafon, I wish it was true that my best was in the last race. <laughs> last race. Um, I've got two more left. Uh, they both got chances. I'm hoping for the best. All the best, Ashton. Well done. Thank you, Mr. Lafon. Just a big thank you to Mr. Puller and well to the owners. Let's talk to Garth, and uh, he's uh, the trainer of Clean Slate. Consist rewarded for consistency. Well done. He's, he's won a good race, this horse. Yeah, thanks to Gavin for his patience. I've got a lot of his horses. Um, he's come through nicely. He, last time he probably hit the front a bit early and rolled around a bit. Um, you know, Serena would normally ride him, 
but Serena had a ride in the race. Um, he was doing well, he working well. It's a horse that I like. He's not an inexpensive horse, but I really do like him. He's a, he's a soldier, thanks to Gavin, as I said, and Dolphy, and uh, the team back at home. And then I've got, obviously, Kathy and Wendy and, and Michael. And then I've got a, a good friend that was a jockey that broke his neck in a swimming pool accident, Bert Abercrombie swimming pool. The guys will know him. He rode with us, and he's a close, very close friend of Gavin Zernheimer's. And I, and I have a few words with him. He wants to talk to you. Fantastic. Lovely. Goth, well done. You've got lots of runners before you run away, competitive throughout the day? No, I haven't got many. I've got one in the seventh that I first run for me, Hollywood. Lovely. Goth with a funny voice today. He's obviously been shouting or a little bit of uh, something wrong with the throat. Good day to you, sir, and welcome. Hi. Okay, thank you. Okay, um, basically, I've come from Cape Town to come and lead in Gavin's horse because we expected him to win, and he did win, and he did win very well. And uh, I must say congratulations to Garth. They turned him out. I mean, he looked beautiful. And uh, yeah, the jockey also rode him very nicely today. So I'm very happy, and I'm sure Gavin is very happy. And when my phone's going to be ringing, I don't know, soon, soon. <laughs> well, it's <laughs> nice to have you in the province, and nice to have you in the winner's enclosure. Thank you for making the trip up, and uh, all the best to you, sir. All right. Thank you very much, and enjoy the day. Lovely. Congratulations. Thanks to the whole team here involved with uh, number 11, Clean Slate. Consistent form, and uh, yeah, he's won well. Well then to Gavin down uh, in the Cape, and to congratulations to you. 11, Clean Slate has won. 11, 7, 5, 4. Those are the numbers you need for race number two.